Windows comes with a lot of features in build and an antivirus is one of them. But it may not always be useful. My name is Yadulla, you're watching Candidate Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can disable Windows Defender in Windows 11. So if you want to disable Windows Defender in Windows 11, there are a few things that you can do. Number one is to just install another antivirus of your choice. As soon as you install another antivirus and enable life protection, Windows Defender automatically shuts itself down. Regardless, if you would want to shut it down on your own, just press the Windows key, uh, search for Windows Security, click it. It should open up the menu, head over to Virus and Threat Protection and then click the manage settings under virus and threat protection settings and now you can disable real-time protection and this will temporarily disable windows defender or windows security whatever you want to call it but if you want to permanently disable the antivirus and we don't recommend doing this there are a few ways you can do that as well before you do it, just scroll down and disable this tamper protection toggle. So it will ask for uh, administrative permissions, give it and then it will show you this warning there. You can dismiss it, uh, you can turn it back on if you want. Uh, this setting disables any other program on Windows from interacting with Windows security so that no malware can accidentally remove or disable this using what we're going to do. Now, once you've disabled this slider, close Windows Security, press Windows key plus R and type Regedit or the registry editor. Hit enter, give it the permissions it needs and now the registry editor will open. We have to head over to HKey local machine. Here's the path. These paths will be in the description below. Just remove this, enter, paste. All right. So as you can see, there is already a registry key here called disable anti spyware. All you have to do is double click it and change this value to one. Make sure that the base is hexadecimal and Windows Defender will be disabled permanently. If you want to revert this change, simply set the value back to zero and you're good to go. You can also do this from the command line if you'd rather not play around in the registry editor. In that case, press the Windows key, search for command prompt, wait for the command prompt to open up and copy paste this command. So what this does is it essentially creates the disable anti spyware keyword if it's not there in, re in the registry editor and sets its value to one. Once again, you can just run this same command um, and change the value to zero if you want to re-enable Windows Defender. All of these commands and the registry links will be in the description below. If you like these videos, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comment section below what more such content can we make for you. If you want to know more about tech, visit our website, candy.technology, follow us on social media, Follow me on Instagram or Twitter and we'll see you in the next video.